Check out this cheeky little birdie. <laughs> on the uh, toilet stack next doors and he's trying to get into the <laughs> into the thing crazy little parrot and your crazy little pretty parrot Somebody doing some four wheel driving. So that's the road we went down a while back, and there was a creek at the bottom. We're going up the other side, we're continuing. So they've got this little track here which is closed off to everything but pedestrians it looks like so it looks like there was an outline of a caravan there that's burnt down we're just going up up the road a little ways not too far Jesse's run. So these are all acreage. They're not farm, but they're more hobby farm size. Looks like these guys are growers. We got uh, a little hutch set up for whatever they're growing and selling. Hello! Because why not? <laughs> Look, it's at play. Well, I think that's our walk. They've got uh, big uh, sheds down there. So I don't know if it's chooks or vegetables or something. fence is not electrified so that's good we can go close to the fence what the sniffing pay what you think is fair well there you go how about that Can't be much more friendly than that. Pay what you think is fair. So we've got an old truck up here. Flatbed truck with limes written on the sign. So another we farmer that's selling limes. Old caravan. The UHF sticker on it. So in other words, they do uh, interstate travel the green nomad thing somebody left the rake out probably when they put the fire out because I think that's fairly recent that that's gone up what do we got I don't know what that is it's not grapes it is a vine and check out this old truck Try and get you in there. Still pretty complete just being parked. Tires are a little dry rotten. It's an old Chevy, was it um, jail bar? There's an old uh, spreader of some sort with a very uncomfortable seat and a very old trailer with wooden spoked wheels check that one out 
Gosh, they're old. Old Dunlop tyres. Made in Australia. Wow, they are old. Nothing's made in Australia nowadays. Nineteen forty-eight is the date on that. There's a horse harness there. Horse bridle. Nineteen forty-eight. That is bloody old. And we're about to go up that hill with this luck. So this is the side we're about to go up. We've just been to the vet. Right, Dougie's got their shots. So it's nearly $600 it cost me. Ouch. And no real troubles. The only thing that I said is that uh, Tikani needs, might need a. I want that turkey. I want that turkey bad. <laughs> Taking me for a walk after that turkey. But they said that, that uh, her teeth need cleaning. Well, they they starting to need to be looked at. So she says that they normally rank them, and they said that her teeth are one out of four. So I bought some toothpaste, because I've never brushed, had, had a dog that needed their teeth brushed. And I asked her if it was, could be because she's not getting as many bones as she used to, and she said, yeah, probably. Because they used to get bones a couple of times a week. Now they're lucky if they get bones once a fortnight because the cost of bones are just too expensive for me at the moment so I've got an old toothbrush and toothpaste you can actually get toothbrush for, for dogs you can actually get a a, um, a tooth cleaning pack which includes a toothbrush Oh, long grass. Nearly as tall as me. She says, I still want that turkey. I want that turkey. So, yes, we did a quick visit to the uh, pet shop. And it was that quick that I didn't even get a chance to record it. And we got flea and tick as well oh how are you supposed to drive up this somebody's tried has done it wow took about steep and slippery and muddy at the moment because it's sprinkling it's not raining it's just sprinkling So, we were wondering why they were put in this road in the last time we were in this area. And Uncle Yukon said it was probably to maintain the lines. And there's the lines up there. And there's two rows of high tension power lines. Oh, the rocky. And my understanding is that Tabletop Mountain is rockier than this. So we're not going to go up there. Oh, sadly, it's, it's too dangerous with the dogs. Yeah, 
Even this is dangerous with the dogs. They're all, everybody's sliding everywhere. And you're supposed to get a service vehicle up here. Yeah, madness. Well, my battery's flat, and unfortunately I didn't realise it was flat. So I'll leave you to it, everybody. <laughs>